Population projections illustrate how the Australian population would change in the future given different scenarios of fertility, life expectancy and migration. Population projections are used by governments, policymakers, planners and businesses to consider how the population may change. The main scenarios that we use for projecting the population are high growth, series A, moderate growth, series B, and low growth, series C. Using series B, Australia's population would double from 23 million people to 46 million people by 2075. However, the population could even double by as early as 2058, according to series A. Series B is the most commonly used scenario and we will now explore the possible future of this projection. These projections reveal some interesting outcomes. The projected population of Greater Perth will overtake that of Greater Brisbane in around 15 years' time, when the population of both Brisbane and Perth reach around 3 million people in 2028. Looking at the states and territories, we can see the projected populations of the ACT in Tasmania reaching 570,000 people in around 25 years' time in 2038. After this, the ACT is projected to continue growing, whilst Tasmania's population is projected to decrease slightly from around 2047 onwards. The projected population of Greater Melbourne will overtake that of Greater Sydney in around 40 years' time, when the population of both Sydney and Melbourne reach 7.9 million people in 2053. So what might Australia look like in 2040? Australia's population is projected to reach 34 million people by 2040, an increase of almost 50% from 2012, or an annual average growth rate of 1.4% per year. When we take a look at the largest increases in the states and territories, we can see the population of Western Australia is projected to reach 4.7 million people in 2040, almost double its 2012 population. This is followed by Queensland, with a projected 60% increase to reach 7.3 million people, and the ACT, with a projected 56% increase to reach 590,000. The smallest percentage increase from 2012 is projected for Tasmania, with an 11% increase reaching 570,000 people. The median age of Australia's population, that is the age at which half of the population is younger and half is older, is projected to increase from 37 in 2012 to a little over 40 in 2040. The number of people aged 65 and over in Australia is projected to double from 3.2 million people to 6.8 million people in 2040. They would represent 20% of the population compared to 14% of the population in 2012. In contrast, the number of children under 15 would represent 17% of the population in 2040 compared to 19% of the population in 2012. So how does the ABS calculate a set of projections? The ABS uses a method that involves making assumptions about future levels of fertility, life expectancy, overseas migration and interstate migration. These are applied to a starting or base population split by sex and age to obtain a projected population for the following year. The assumptions are then applied to this new projected population to obtain a projected population for the next year and so on through to the end of the projection period. These projections do not incorporate the non-demographic factors which influence population change, such as government migration policy, improvements in health treatment or the occurrence of natural disasters, and are therefore distinct from predictions or forecasts of what the population of Australia will actually look like in the future. Thank you for watching. More information on these population projections can be found in the Population Projections Australia publication or by clicking on the population clock on the ABS homepage.